Good day to you all day. I hope you are enjoying your day. Very good. I have a question here for you on mathematics. The question says, convert 341.23 base 8 to base 10. It is obvious that this question is from conversion of number of bases. That is the first thing you need to identify when you are given any question in mathematics. But most of us are familiar with the conversion of a whole number. That is, those value without the decimal point. I want us to look at how we can convert this decimal point now from base 8 to base 10. So let's go. Solution now. Here, for us to convert from 341, 341.23 base 8 to base 10 now. Now, you know that in the conversion of a whole number, you start your power, the power that you put on it, you start increasing it from the right hand side here towards the left hand side. The same thing is going to happen here. But for your understanding, I'm going to treat it this way. From before this point here, those values that are there are sign 0, 1, 2 on them. The way we normally do it in our conversion of a whole number as well. Now, after the point, put minus 1, minus 2. If you look at it very well, you can agree with me that this number, the lowest value we have of this power is this minus 2. Why the highest value is this plus 2. Now, it increases from the right hand side towards the left hand side like this. So, then you now apply your power expansion. In solving this question, applying power expansion now, we are going to have 3 multiplied by 8 raised to the power 2 plus 4 multiplied by 8 raised to the power of 1 plus 1 multiplied by 8 raised to the power of 0 plus 2 multiplied by 8 raised to the power of minus 1 plus 3 multiplied by 8 raised to the power of minus 2 that is the value you are going to have for now then when you have that then you start your multiplication and addition accordingly from there now this will be 3 multiplied by 8 raised to the power 2 is 64 plus 4 multiplied by 8 raised to the power 1, 1 is 8 plus 1 multiplied by 8 raised to the power 0 is 1 plus 2 multiply by this value here will turn this this negative value here will turn this particular 8 raised power into a reciprocal it becomes reciprocal of 8 raised power of 1 plus 3 multiplied by 8 raised power of 2 please follow it that way you can see that it is only this my negative value that is no longer here it has turned this value here into a reciprocal now we go ahead. 3 multiplied by 64 here, we are going to have 192. 192 plus 4 times 8 is 32, plus 1 times 1 is 1, plus 2 over 8 raised power of 1 is 8, plus 3 over 8 raised power 2 will give you 64. All this value here will give us a whole number which is going to be 2 to 5 plus 2 over 8 plus 3 over 64. We have the fraction here. These two are fractions, so we have to find their LCM. I'm saying this is 64. 8 in 64 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. Plus, 64 in 64 is 1. 1 times 3 is 3. So the answer will now give us 2, 2, 5, whole number, the one we have here, 19 over 64. That is the value base 10 now. It is now in base 10. That is the answer to that question. We do implore you to subscribe to our channel for detailed information about this topic. We only pick a question there. 
you have many other topics you can as well get the information on from there thank you and god bless